Uh, our branch over the last few years have uh, gone from being a service branch to an organising branch. Our membership stands at around over 5,000 members. Um, we've had huge recruitment this year. It's been a record-breaking recruitment of nearly 600 members already, which again, again is, is a record for our open branch. One of the jobs I was tasked to do was, was, was build a team. Um, and one of the things I built was a, an organising team that was beneficial to the members and, and move the, the branch forward. Well, our sort of real drivers be as visible as we can, speak to as many members on the shop floor if you like. Um, so it's very rare, there's, a, there's any workspace in an Iron Bevan really that doesn't have the visibility of Unison. A union in, in some ways, um, especially when in a branch office, is, is so removed from the membership. They only see us when, it, when there's an issue or they're in, there's a problem occur. But well, by, by the way we deal with things, by being out and, and, and mixing with the members and, go, and, and putting on different functions, I, th I think it, it brings us to them because we, we, we actually meet with them and talk with them before there is a problem. We do family fun days. We recently took 10 coaches to Bath on a Christmas shopping trip. And there was nearly, there was over 400 members of units and members and their families we took there. We like to think our recruitment is reflecting all the, you know, all the work we're doing. So. I really understand the value the trade unions bring to, uh, to work, the value they bring to services. And so when I became the chair of this health board, the one thing I wanted to do was to establish some really good relationships with our trade unions. We've got a really strong partnership council here in the Nara Bevan Health Board. And I know that that's the reason why we're the best health board in Wales. We've got the highest performance in Wales. We've got the best efficiency in Wales. I don't deliver anything. It's the staff and in particular our, our, our work with the representatives of the staff which enable us to achieve so much. I think it reflects in, in, in our recruitment figures in a lot of ways because we've gone from, from one extreme to another where we were, we were ticking along, yeah, we were ticking along fine. And now we've gone off the chart. In fact, we had to put a new chart on top to actually to deal with the figures because, you know, we're looking at, um, we're looking at 600 plus, which is, which is like 110, 115% of our target. What more can I ask?